Good morning, Gators. This is John Ferguson. And R.J. Ferguson. Today is Friday, November 1st, 2019, which is also the 4-H project for 5th grade. For lunch today, we will be having chicken sandwich or vegetable beef soup with a grilled cheese sandwich. For breakfast, for breakfast on Monday, we will be having pancakes or cheese toast. Mm. Now for the weather. It's going to be mostly sunny, but much cooler today and through the weekend. We will start in the mornings off in the mid-30s and will warm up to only the mid to upper 50s the next few days. Now for some important announcements. Daylight savings time ends on Sunday. That means the time will change and we will fall back. So set your clocks back one hour. Santa's coming to our school next Friday for Santa pictures. Ho, 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 ho. Nevaeh Wallen earned another hexagon for the Carpenter Beehive. Bailey House completed another book project earning a hexagon for the Carpenter Bees. Jaden Washington earned a hexagon for the Bumblebee Hive. Jude Baker earned one for the Honeybee Hive. Aiden McGuire completed the Illustrated Dictionary Book Project, earning the Honeybees another hexagon and his larvae, larva batch. Ariel Fricks, Zaria Allen, and Liam Langston each earned hexagons for the Leafcutter Bee Hive. Good job. Chance Farley earned a hexagon for the River Hive. Woo! Strand Guthrie completed a book talk project, earning another hexagon for the leaf cutters. Bees, take a look at his book talk. Hey guys, my name is Strand, and I'm going to be reading you Sharks and Dolphins. The author is Kevin Kurtz. The title of the book is Sharks and Dolphins. There are many interesting pictures of sharks that show their teeth and giant fins. Did you wonder that dolphins can breathe underwater. Read this book to find out how they can breathe underwater. There are over 400 kinds of sharks. I never knew that dolphins were very good swimmers. Do you want to know more about sharks and dolphins? Come check this out at the iHub. Later, Gators. We hope everyone is remembering our Gator expectation and earning Chompy Cash. Yes. It's now November, so we have a new character word of the month. Our new word is gratitude. Having gratitude means you're thankful and show appreciation for acts of kindness shown to you. You may even show gratitude by doing acts of kindness for those that have been kind to you. Now, now for birthdays. Today we have Isabel Butler, Joseph Hill, and Gunnar Phillips. Tomorrow we have Alice McGraw and Emma Thompson. On Sunday we have Molly Walker. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday. Be sure to go by the office after announcements and pick up your birthday surprise. Now let's stand for the pledges. Now for the pledge to the American flag. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. Now for the pledge to the Georgia flag. I, I pledge allegiance to the Georgia flag and to the principles for which it stands, wisdom, justice, and moderation. Now for the Gator, now pledge. Now for the gator pledge. I am a Gator. gator. 
I pledge to be responsible and respectful too. I pledge to be kind and safe in all that I do. In the Gator Zone, I will stay. I will do my best each and every day. At the direction of your teacher, let's now pause for a moment of silence. Make it a great day, Gators, and be kind. Make sure to use one squirt of soap and hand sanitizer to kill them yucky germs. Later, Gators. But don't use too much.